Every weekend, Book TV brings you 48 hours of history, biography, and public affairs. Here's a quick look at one of our programs. We have a question right here. And we'll continue to work our way around the room. Is the motivation uh, for women going into the uh, military, um, did you find it any different than uh, the reason that men go into the military other than the nurses? Well, I think there are a whole range of reasons. Some women told me, you know, it sounds very much like Kara's nurses, that they really wanted to escape their small towns. Uh, they didn't want to live like their friends who were marrying young and having lots of babies. Other women wanted adventure. They wanted to go to war. Uh, they really wanted to fight. I talked to one woman who was German who had actually emigrated to the United States because she was too old for the German military and she really wanted to fight in war. The ones with the family and the children, the same, I mean, what would be their motivation? I mean, some of it was also economic. There were many women I talked to who came from real poverty. Um, I mean, very serious poverty, and for them, the military was a way out. I spoke with many, many women who had been teen mothers, you know, and had children very, very young, and they saw this as a career path, and it was, it was a good career path. And, you know, uh, in light of the current debates over health care, right, there were several women who had children with diseases or health conditions and they needed good insurance, and that's why they joined the military. And, and um, that just makes me think, um, what was the socioeconomic background of the women who were joining as nurses in Vietnam? It was, it was pretty widespread as well. Um, the economic factor was a big motivator for most young nurses. Um, there was a split largely in the Vietnam War of career nurses who had been in for quite some time. Um, and then the young nurses that were recruited straight out of nursing school, most of those had signed up through what was called the Army Student Nurse Program, which is essentially the ROTC for nurses. Um, and most nurses had signed up for those educational benefits. Um, so it, again, it's a whole range of motivations. Mm -hmm. um, men who were nurses signed up because they knew if they were drafted, the Army might decide they make good infantrymen mm -hmm. as opposed to good nurses. Um, so that the draft is, essentially explains men's motivations. Um, women were obviously quite different. You don't have to wait for the weekend to watch our programs. Watch online at booktv.org and follow us on Twitter.